short weeks ago, the members of the band enjoyed the trip of a lifetime as the National Football League made it possible for us to fly to London to perform in Wembley Stadium as part of the NFL's International Series. Let's take a look. As far as I'm concerned, and to my understanding, uh, the band's first international opportunity has been actually to perform inside Wembley Stadium, so it's kind of an absolute honor to be able to perform here. And now, please look up to the sky. I really enjoy working with the students. I'm a teacher and an educator at heart. Uh, I've, I've spent a lot of years teaching public school, and just to have, have the opportunity to teach on this level is really rewarding for me. and our, I knew our students were going to be ready to do it. I always get nervous before big performances like this, and I always spend the time just thinking through every aspect of the show. But when it, when it went off as well as it did, uh, I was thrilled and just relaxed because I knew the students did a great job. In the stadium on game day, we introduced the crowd to the largest British brass band in the world. Then, celebrating our time in London, we turned back Big Ben's clock 50 years for music for the time that we Yanks call the British Invasion.
yesterday. But it was time to flip back the clock to 2015 and get ready to come home. Alas, we had to call time on our show with a swing past some of the local landmarks we'll remember from our time in London before thanking our host and celebrating the very special relationship between our two peoples. Here's the finale. Thank you so much.